Hello, my name is Fitz Carmel Lamar, and I'm the creator of New Bedford, a graphic novel based here in New Bedford, which is where I'm a transplant to. And I've started the New Bedford Survivor Series, which uh, is brought to you by the Community Foundation, uh, the New Bedford Housing Authority, and Third Eye Unlimited. Uh, and basically, they've given me the opportunity as a graphic novelist, and uh, I've done community programming and educating and worked in the school systems as well, to bring uh, creative writing workshops, uh, photography workshops, uh, and all these other creative activities, uh, as well as supplies to kids uh, in these housing developments, and showing them how to use these tools as well. Um, and so far we've, we do have a Facebook page, which, uh, you're more than welcome to, uh, check out and see what we got going there. But, uh, a lot of the story, uh, that they're going to be creating, uh, me and another local artist are going to create into actual pages. And we're going to do, we're doing this alongside with showing the kids the process and getting them, uh, creating their own comics. But in the same vein, but so they can understand the structure that we're using uh, with creating thumbnails and the sequential art itself and producing it and reproducing it and working these same pages over and creating a, 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 a polished result and giving them the equipment to do this, these kinds of things. Art is like something I can do that will like calm, like calm me down. Like it would be something I can do during my free time. Um, I'm not more much of a drawer or anything like that. I just decided to come to the program to see what it's like. What does your new Bedford mean to you? My new Bedford? I mean, it's really tough down. Like it's really not a bad place to be. It's just depending on how you've grown up. So basically, based on the way I've grown up with the kids I've grown up with, it's really not that bad. It's actually kind of cool here. You're just really underestimating. Well, the is my community. I came here when I was 13, um, and there's a there's a lot of ethnicity in here. There's a lot of different languages and people, and it's it's a community. Yeah. Uh, the prologue, available on Amazon, uh, that is out and we're showing the kids how to create these things with local uh, resources as well. So, because that's how I ended up doing it myself and creating a body of work that we now uh, are able, with this funding, to bring to these kids and show the creative process that is used to create a polished piece of work. And so now we're inspiring these young artists with real life skills and the finished product is that these kids are gonna end up getting published in the graphic novel. And so, I'd like to definitely thank all the partners that are involved, especially uh, the 10 survivors who are sticking with the program and getting, uh, we're getting a lot of great results there. We're building a lot of uh, great relationships out there with these kids and the parents. Um, so I thank you for the opportunity and I think we're going to really be able to inspire these kids to, to do something great with, uh, with their newfound talents. And a lot of them already had it. It was just a matter of having some form of programming to, to flesh that out. Thank you very much and have a great day.